good morning. It's another day. It's another Disneyland Paris vlog. We are heading to Walt Disney Studios this morning. Oh. Joe's here. Um, the plan is get there for extra magic and then try and get as much done as we possibly can. And then we are going to leave the parks and head over to Valde Europe for some shopping. Yeah. Check it out, we've never been. Yeah. So that's the plan for this morning. And then we'll see what happens later on this evening. So let's get to Walt Disney Studios. And we made it. <sighs> Finally. That was too bad. No, it's all right. Although this is all hotel guests. Yeah. So it's quite busy. Thankfully, we used the pass holder line. Here we go. Oh, it's Mickey. There he is. Saying hello. You got a wave at him, Joe. I've got a wave at him. <laughs> hey, Mickey. <laughs> He's funny. He's funny. Right. Let's go do some stuff. So, everyone's going to Crush. Where? Crush. Remy's. Yeah, we're going to Tower Terror. Yeah. Where are you going to that one? Oh, way to wake yourself up. There's a Quinjet in that. No, I, w I want to have a look at that. The Quinjet is up, but I don't know whether you can see it. Yeah. Won't be long. Because actually, that's changed since last time we were here. Because yeah, the, the stage, they've come out more. Um, look at that. Is that Crush? That is Crush. Ugh. What's wrong with people? No, I don't, I don't get it. Or is Tower Terror No. Yeah, Tower Terror, 100%. Yeah, they're letting on. How long is it? Five minutes? Five minutes. Have you come? Yes, I'm getting rid of this, getting rid of my drink. And, we're about to drop from the skies. Yeah, I'm not a massive fan of Crush, so I'm not overly bothered. So... And they're walking straight up. It literally is walk on. This is the way to do it. Yep. <laughs> Bonjour. Oh my God. Yeah, see, normally we've had to queue up here and all around there. But now we're straight in, literally. Straight on. I've never got to this part as quickly even in Florida. <laughs> oh, big yawn from Joe. The clock's wrong. It says it's five past eight in the morning. Or is that five past eight at night? I don't know. Is that what time the... Uh, I'm like guessing maybe it was. From memory, this one's quite far. This is like the you Guardian's one. Away, don't you? you go straight away. And then it does the drop in like Guardians. Yeah. So there you have it. Let's woke us up. Oh, there. I thought I'll... That one is mad. <laughs> yeah. That it's one like... is definitely. Makes your stomach go more. Yeah, no, definitely. without a doubt. The, the line for Crush is still ridiculous. Like, I don't get it. Like, maybe it's because there's a limited number of rides, but I just would not queue that long for for that ride. It's not even that great, in my opinion. Um, we're going to head around to Toy Story Land because um, RC Racer is showing as a five minute wait. 
so hopefully it is and we can get on it let's check it out here we are Toy Soldier's Parachute Drop RC Racer now is RC Racer open? I've not seen it go yet so it might not be open we shall see RC Racer five minutes needs to be done Right on the Scale Electrics track. Yeah. I had Scale Electrics, but it was just like a figure eight one. Yeah. I found it boring. It was fun, but then once you set it up and like literally, like, oh first yeah, couple of cars and then you're like, oh, um, there we go. It's not really race because they just go at the <laughs> normal speed. <laughs> Right. Nah, because I like speeding them up. <laughs> How'd you speed them up? I'm squeezing the trigger faster. Oh. Uh. Right, let's get on RC Racer. Oh, there we go. RC that was racer. hilarious. <sighs> I was just at the top good. As I was coming down, I was like, oh my god. That was funny. It does wake you up. Yeah. <laughs> the it is like bit, a. Going like back. Absolutely fine. It's just that it's the forward bit. Well, yeah, it's like when you go, when you've gone back and then you're coming back down. Yeah, and you're like, Ugh. yeah. Right, we are now in France. Bonjour. Bonjour. We are in France, obviously. Ah. Oh. Yeah, I I definitely give it to Walt Disney World. What Yeah. 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 That's the thing, though. It's not as big. Uh, that, that's not as big as the one in um, Orlando in Epcot. No. Yeah, it's cool though. It's nice, but obviously Orlando is on a bigger scale. 60 minute wait for Ratatouille. So this is where the Avengers Compass is going to be. You can see the tops of bits kind of come in. Coming along. Actual Avenger Camp uh, Avengers Campus. Because you've got the Iron Man ride, which is what's gonna be was the old rock and roller coaster. Yeah. And then you've got the Spider Man Spider Man, the the slingshot web, web slingers. Yeah. Can't wait. Yeah, it'd be good once it's done. I just want to know a date. Of when it is. Yeah, I think it might be end of, towards the end of the summer. Um, so yeah, so we've obviously walked around in a circle. Um, there isn't really much here. Crush is like 110 minutes. Nah. So that's a no. That's a no. And that made you feel sick last time. That did make me feel sick. Not, not, not today. So yeah. It's, it needs Avengers Campus to be opened soon because there needs to be something else to see and do. Because um, I think we could easily go, we're kind of done here. There are a few shows that you want to watch, but they didn't start until later. Yeah. So without kind of wasting some time just walking around, we could go and do something else. What should we do? Watch the space. from Walt Disney Studios to Val de Europe. Basically, we're just in a normal shopping mall. Yeah, it does remind me of the Mall Cribs Causeway a little bit. <laughs> yeah. But, but we'll yeah. see, see what's here. There is a Primark. Primarni. There's a Primarni. There is also like an outlet shopping area. Oh, is that? Like, a bit like Clark's Village. Oh, okay. Oh, just see the Marvel store over there. That's Disney store. I need a pair of sunglasses. 
there is a weird smell in the air. A little bit fishy, not going to lie. Very fishy. <laughs> it's quite cool though. Like any shopping mall is, I suppose. It's not busy, which is a good thing. Anyone for lingerie? <laughs> it's not my type. <laughs> we found Primark. Let's do some shopping. Disney stuff and dog stuff. That's what I'm looking for. Let's find it. We found it. We found a Disney. Is that first show? There you go. But these all women's. We got the fluff. Well, that's interesting. You put your biscuits in. Ah, cup of tea. Cup of tea and biscuits. Rolling pin. Cookie cutters. Get a Mickey Mouse pan. That's quite funny. Mickey Mouse eggs. Cake pop maker. Oh, that's cool. It's heavy then. You won't be bringing that back in a case. What is that? Cuddle cushion. Yeah. Oh, the girls like that. I'm cuddling into it. Pegwood. Pegwood. Primark's a no for me, surprisingly. Didn't find anything. The dog stuff wasn't great, was it? We might have to look for another place to get some dog toys. Because you can't come away and leave the dogs and not get them a present. Yeah. We'll find something. We'll On to the next. We've come outside for some fresh air. Yeah. It's a lovely day today. Yeah, Starting to warm up as well. Warming up. Um, we're going to be heading over to the village bit. So it's kind of like, um, like an outlet style shopping area. I don't know what's there, but we we'll check it out, we'll find out, see if it's any good. But I imagine it's a bit like Bister, Clark's yeah. Village, Bister, kind of, similar yeah. to that. Let's, uh, let's take a look. So yeah, this is definitely like Bister yeah. and Clark's. Armani Outlet, Tommy Hilfiger, Levi. Hey, is it any cheaper? Well, I doubt it. Armani code, they might do. Yeah, it's very pretty though. If you like your designer clothes yeah. and you've got a small fortune to spend, then crack on. <laughs> a, large <laughs> a large fortune, depending on how much you want to buy. Pretty though. We've left La Village. We're too common for that. Far too common. Nice, very pretty. Very pretty. But. None of the shops. Well, they're not outlets. So, like where you've got like Bister, which are like designer outlet shops. These aren't really outlets. They're just designer shops. Yeah. Um, but which have like ten percent off or something like that. Not even which that. Which puts some it of them. cheaper, but puts it at a price of like maybe a hundred and <laughs> yeah. eighty quid for a t-shirt. But the um, yeah, it is all your designer shops. But some of them you need reservations to actually go into them. So yeah, we are walking back around now. To go back into Valley Europe. Um, I found a Hagen Dazs shop. So, of all the things I can come to Valley Europe, Hagen Dazs. Hagen Dazs is my go to. <laughs> Shock horror. Um, we haven't walked along the bottom of Valley Europe yet. We've only walked along the top end. Again, nothing major. We looked in Primark, we looked in Uniqlo. Nothing really there. Um, we'll see what's along the bottom. And then Hagen Dars for me. I've just had like a fly or a bug touch my face. Hagen Dars for me. And then back to the hotel.
we made it to Hagen Dazs. Okay. Yeah. Do you know what you're having? I don't know yet. Do you know what you're having? Oh, yeah. Hi. Um, what do you think they come in? What size box? Three scoops. Can I get the three scoops yes. just of the strawberry cheesecake, please? Yes, please. You're getting three different. Yeah. yeah. We got our Hogan Dads. We got some ice cream. This is what we got, Joe. <laughs> Joe got just coffee. I like just coffee. Just coffee. It's good. And I went for the strawberry cheesecake, which is my favourite Hagen Dazs flavour. It's so good with little chunks of biscuit, shortbread biscuit. Yum, yum, yum. How's yours? Nice? Lush. But I'm a fan of coffee, so. Yeah, I don't like coffee. Yeah. How's yours? Mine's good, but I hate wooden spoons. Why? I don't know, I feel like they rub. It's like, you know, you got ice lolly, you got ice lolly stick. Yeah. I don't like that texture, that film. It makes me go funny. Right, I'm gonna eat my Hagen Dars. So, from Hagen Dars <laughs> to Disneyland Park. Yep. We have made it back to the parks. And in time for a Disney parade. So, we're looking forward to watching that. We haven't seen that yet. And uh, let's get in the parks.
So, we've come for a little pit stop, haven't we, Ryan? We're a bit peckish. So, Ryan's just got some little chippies. And I went for some Doritos with cheese sauce. You don't like the cheese sauce on these, though, do you? I don't like the runny cheese sauce. You think it tastes like fake cheese, even though it is fake it cheese. cheese. Yeah, but it tastes good, I like it. And that's it, you're smothering it in mayo. Yes. Paprika Yeah, they look nice. It's fine, I got plenty of these. I wonder if they are actual Doritos or whether they're just like. They don't. Look like they don't. No. How's yours? Good. Yeah. Mine. They just taste like what you'd get in. Oh, was it? Pecco's Bill. They taste like them. They're nice. We made it to Discovery and it is time for Hyperspace Mountain. 30 minute wait. I can cope with that. That isn't going to kill me, although, is it 30 minutes? I have a feeling it could be longer. Hopefully, it moves quick. Let's go to space. So we did hyperspace again. After what, 45 minutes? 45 minutes. It broke down whilst we were in the queue. Uh, yeah, but hey, it was all right. I'm still not 100% convinced on it. We are now in Adventureland. Look, there we are. You used to be able to go on the boat, but I haven't seen anybody on it. No, I've not no, seen anyone on it. No. Um, yeah, we are in Adventureland because we have a dining reservation for Captain Jack's. That is the restaurant that is technically inside of the Pirates of the Caribbean ride. So we are going to go there and, oh, shock horror, have some food. Eating. We're eating. We're always uh, eating. Always eating. We want to just find out all the best dishes, that's why. So, let's see. Mm. This is Captain Jack's. Do you know what you're having? Food. Don't know what food yet. I'm, I've, you've already looked at the menu. I've looked at the menu. Yeah, I've not looked. I can't wait. I am starving. Yeah, I mean, we've not eaten much today, have we? Really? We had a sandwich this morning. Yeah, then we had some haagen Then we had some... I had some chips, you had some nachos. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, we've not had those today. No. We've been good. Thought about food a lot today. Thought about it, but not yeah, eating it. Sleepy Joe. Mm, yeah, I didn't see very well last night. Yeah. Mm. Four hours sleep. Room's too hot, that's too spongy. <laughs> it's not great. He's a happy Jack. I'm alright, I am happy. I'm just I'll take some pro plus later. Yeah. Ready for tomorrow. So we've got a choice of starters. Main courses. I'm going to have the Caribbean chicken and prawns with the captain's rice. And then you've got a list of desserts. There's quite a few desserts. I think Joe, are you having the fish? Uh, I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna just have what you have. You're gonna have the chicken and prawn, Caribbean, uh, captain's rice. Yeah. Don't want the fish. No, I had just, I just had a quick look at what a mahi mahi fish looks like. <laughs> it scared you. <laughs> yeah, it looks angry. It's an angry fish. Um, dessert wise, there is a few on there, but I do like the taste sensation celebration, which is part of the 30th dishes. Yeah. Um, if you're on a meal plan as well, you can do a meal plan. So the meal plan is 42 euros, or the kids meal plan is 22. Quite a range. I like the setting though. Yeah. I like the front as well. Yeah. So basically this bit here, that 
is the ride, isn't it? That's Pirates of the Caribbean. Yeah. Might do Pirates after this. Yeah. And then try and put a shot in of where we were. It's cool though, with all the light in. Although all I can hear is pirates music in the background. Yo ho. We've been playing that a bit. Yeah. It's cool though. We have a lovely bush next to us. A little candle. Candlelight supper. Enjoy yourselves. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. And most importantly, catch up and drink up me heart. Me my hearties. My hearties. Yo ho, Captain Jack Sparrow. You did that in the best pirate impression. No, I can do it now. That's not good on camera. Not good on camera. There he is. Joe. Jack. <laughs> the resemblance is uncanny. So this is, it's going to be a bit dark, but this is the chicken prawn. Let's see if I can lay it up there. Light it up. There you go. Oh, it's nice. It looks amazing. And then you get a little pot in a coconut shell. Oh, is that a coconut oh, the rice. shell? It's a coconut shell. That's cute. That is cool. That is cool. <laughs> Smells good. And because of pass order, you get a little free cocktail. So we've eaten. Yeah. Now it's time for dessert. Food That's mains was lovely. Great. Very it's tasty. Like chicken, rice, coconut, almond flakes, carrots. Yeah. Um, bit of a spice bit kick of to it. Humany spice. Yeah. Nice though. It's nice. But what's nicer is dessert. Wow. I mean, I'll try and put it up to the light. I'll put it up here and it's a bit lighter. I mean, looks and smells amazing. Yeah. Joe went for a different. Mine just looks like a little mouse. Look at the little mouse. It's cute. Let's add some light. There we go. <laughs> and that's cute. That is cool. I like the plates. Yeah, I kind of hate Put them in your bag. Put them in your bag, Joe. Put them in your bag. Put the plates in your yeah, bag. Yeah, these are very similar to the other... Um, that Pandora. Pandora. Yeah, that's that kind of style. It's that style and that colour. Mm. So yeah. anyway, we're going to tuck gonna in. It's going to be the same, Jeff, is it going to be the same as like the blueberry mousse in Pandora? Possibly. Let's try it and see. Time for pirates. Hey hey. Oh, nice little chilled ride to let our food settle. Three drops. Oh yeah, forget about the drops. Oh, it's very dark. Yeah, very dark. So we're back in the room. We last vlogged pirates. Um, so after Pirates, we headed into Frontierland. Joe did some shopping. Yeah. What did you buy, Joe? Well, he was on a special purchase. Um, it was like spend 20 euros and get him for 9.99, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, and me and you both seen these, so I opened them up. We opened them up a few days ago, didn't we? We did. They're, they're really nice. But they're, like, they're quite small, but they're quite nice. Like, got... They're a nice size mug, I think. Yeah, they're nice. So I bought two of those. They're nine euros each. Um, so that comes at 18. Um, and then, because uh, we collect them as well. We're weird. Um, oh yeah, we've got the bag. We've got the bag. They're two euros. So that took it to 30 euros exactly. Now, 20 euros exactly, not bad. And then obviously put him on, he was 9.99, so he's cute. He is cute. Yeah, now, I do think 
there are two little things that would love him. They're not having him. But they, he, they're not He's allowed. Doing all my little Mickey collection. But that nose, they would love. And they would chew his nose. They chewed the other one, didn't they? They did. A big Mickey for them, but yeah. not. Yeah, I um, yeah, so, but then obviously I got annual pass discount on it. Annual pass discount? Took it down to 27 99 so. Yeah, saved a couple of euros. Two euros off. Um, but we did get something for the pugs. Because, you know, you can't come away without getting something for the pugs. Um, and these, they can chew. Can? They can. So, for Da, you are the Dumbo. We we picked up kind of two of these when we were on our last Disneyland Paris trip. We picked up a kind of baby Pluto and a baby it's Lady from Lady and the Tramp. Tramp. They have been destroyed. Um, but yeah, so Daph's got Dumbo. How cute. And then Peggy the Pig. She's got Pua. Pua. From Moana. From Moana. Yeah, Moana. yeah. Apologies if you can hear it and hear anything that I'm saying. Joe is wrapping up his mug, so that's all you might hear in the background. Um, but yeah, so that's what we've got, Peggy. And that's what we've got, Daphne. So they've got a little something. A little super there. For, um, for when, and then, yeah, got the bag as well. Which is quite a cool bag. What's interesting is on the back, obviously you've got the 30th on the front, but on the back, you actually have Avengers Campus, you have Spider-Man. And well, it says ETE. 2022. What does ETE stand for? Coming soon, basically. Yeah. So, yeah, which isn't going to be long. Um, so yeah, so that was it, that was our last night. We didn't stay for Illuminations, because we watched that last night. Um, we kind of left the park just before all the, kind of the, the crowds did, so it made it a little bit easier to get to get back. Um, but now all that is left is for us to pack because tomorrow we are checking out the hotel um, we're at the parks during the day and our flight is on the evening so we've got a few hours at the park before we get the magical express shuttle magic shuttle back to the airport yeah. um, we're flying from Paris Orly though we're flying back from Orly we flew into Charles de Gaulle but we're fly flying back from Orly so we need to get packed so, all that's left to be said is that's pretty much it for this episode. We will see you again tomorrow, which will technically be next Sunday at 4pm. Make sure you subscribe to give this video a thumbs up. Yep. But until then... Drop a comment as well. Drop a comment. It's adios from me. Cheerio. Bye. Bye.